Good day, YouTube. This is just a bit of a quick, fun baseline RAM comparison video between Kali Linux on the left latest release and Windows latest release on the right version 11, right? So starting off, what we do is need to open up a terminal for the Linux-based Kali, and type in the following, so htop to bring up the, the system monitor, and then on the right-hand side for Windows, of course, the task manager there. Now, uh, I will mention one thing, so Kali Linux comes in different varieties. This is actually the really nice and cool uh, KDE Plasma desktop environment variant. So the Plasma desktop, just a nice cool one, usually a little bit more heavyweight than other versions of Linux, but hey, is what it is there. Now, uh, starting off, uh, we've got about 785 megabytes, so let's say 800 megabytes of RAM on boot up for Kali Linux, which isn't great, to be honest. It's, it's pretty average for, for Linux. Um, and then on the right-hand side, Windows, we've got about 1.6 uh, gigabytes of RAM on boot up. So you're not looking at double, but you are looking at about 80% more of RAM on boot up, which isn't fantastic when you're dealing with notebooks and uh, netbooks and anything with a book at the end of it. But uh, that's pretty much it, guys. I just wanted to show you a quick uh, baseline comparison there. We can have a look at the CPU if you want as well, but that's just mostly idling off on both uh, accounts there at the moment. No extra processors running in the background. So thanks again, guys. Thanks for watching. Please leave a comment, subscribe, hit that like button, and I do hope to see all of you guys there in the next one.